Hi everyone, Manuela Marquijani from Isomer Skin Care. And today we're going to talk about something I find really interesting um, because it's kind of romantic. It's not really scientific, but uh, it's, it's good to share the knowledge and, and to share the experience, right? So today we're going to talk about rose water skin care. So what is that? That is skin care made from rose water. And how do you make rose water? You take rose petals and you distill them a little bit or you put them into a mixture of slurry or some just put them in boiling water or just regular water and you let those essential oils kind of come out of the out of the roses. It's you know, I find it interesting because as a young girl, my mom would tell me about when she was in Italy, they would take rose, rose petals and they would actually make rose water. Um, and my husband, he's um, Iranian, and of course they use rose water. They have rose water in skincare. They have it in desserts. We drink it, you know, in, in the summer to cool us down. So it has a lot of, uh, a great fragrance, right? It evokes a lot of pleasant kind of memories and pleasant kind of sensations. Uh, roses are, you know, all about love, but in and of itself, the rose has benefits. It has antioxidant benefits. It has skin calming and soothing benefits. You know, it takes away redness and irritation. It's very mild. It's very hydrating. It's very gentle. So it does have benefits in that sense. I don't think it's a heavy duty anti-aging ingredient. I don't think it's a heavy duty, you know, balancing uh, uh, element if you have breakout or if you have some kind of severe irritation. But I do think it's fun and I do think it's pleasant and I do think it's completely safe to use. There's everything right with it. If you want to use a little bit of rose water as a toner, put a little bit in, you know, a cleanser, have it on your skin because you want to just freshen and brighten up or just enjoy the essence itself because it is uplifting, it is calming, it is soothing, and it does show promise um, as a gentle ingredient with, with a bit of a balancing, bit of a hydrating, bit of a soothing benefit to it. So telling you all about this rose water makes me want to go have some Turkish delight now because it has rose water in it too. Actually, there's one uh, dessert that I absolutely love. It's called uh, Icicles from Heaven. I'm gonna, I wanna say it in Farsi, but I'm gonna probably make it sound funny, but Yachte Behesht, is that right? Yachte Close. Behesht. Yes, Yachte Behesht. And that is like the most delicious, I'm Italian, so it's like panna cotta with rose water in it. So yes, enjoy your rose water any way you like it if you want to use it in your skincare and it's absolutely fine i do caution you though with rose water they're not all created equal so look for um, quality product or if you're going to just use it as a cleanser or a toner just have fun with any one you have but make sure it doesn't have things like alcohol or you know really really toxic kind of ingredients in there just make sure that it's kind of nice and neutral and easy to use and you'll just have fun with it.